Greetings from the province of Ifugao, Kotat at Ifugao in Vienna, clinching a niche in the tourism industry for Ifugao is a vision we aspire for that your invitation is very opportune and timely as we gradually open our tourism industry after COVID-19. We are honored to be the highlighted province of this year's celebrations of your organizations in the land of the famous famed Danube River for which are grateful the exposure will surely reap fruits for our province and the region too. Gutentag, good day, your team, indigenous roots, timeless heritage, distinct culture, enduring community. Aptly captured the essence of the elite Ifugo celebration of the Gutat. We are all Cordillerans, sharing commonalities in culture but it's distinguished by our unique and distinct indigenous attributes. The Kotat is a cultural heritage that defines the very soul and character of the Ifugaos. It is the climax of a series of prestige festivals performed by a rich couple. In today's context, the Kotat at Ifugao is the hallmark cultural festival that highlights the separations of the province from Mountain Province in June 18, 1966 by virtue of Republic Act 4695, otherwise known as the Division Law of Mountain Province. A milestone of the history of Ifugao, like your annual celebration highlighting our unity as Cordilleras, the Gotad has primordial goal to promote protect, preserve, and perpetuate the unique indigenous knowledge system and practices of the Ifugao people that plays a key role in sustaining our resiliency and continuity as a people and as a province. The Gotad at Ifugao binds the 11 municipalities of to come together in celebration through singing dancing and drinking features array of activities highlighting our Ifugao culture, customs, and traditions through the cultural parade, float contest, performing arts competition on Ifugao dances and chants, and gong beating, and competition on indigenous ethnic games, ethnic skills, and indigenous culinary arts that culminates with a lens for the public for Punhidaan. A close look at these cultural festivals reveals a lot of altruistic wisdom that needs to be advocated and promoted. Foremost is the spirit of sharing and the resulting fellowship or communion. But that has been a way by which those who possess Payo, Ricefield, and Moyong, at least food and drinks with those who have blessed. The host of the Gotad is obliged to invite everyone, relatives, both near and far, and village mates, whether rich or poor. People eat the same food and wine. Also neighbors of the host are in a way obliged to brew wine from their own produce to be served during the week-long celebration. Another key figure is the spirit of hope. Time is accorded guest to enunciate the waga or the blessing for the host family or couple. The message usually were blessings Blessings for the work of the hands to be fruitful, for the livestock, poultry, swine, and cattle to be plentiful, and the field produce to be high yielding, and for the present and next generations to prosper. It can be said that the same spirit of sharing and hope are preserved 
and promoted in the present version of the Grand Crotad as people from all walks of life in the 11 municipalities come together to the capital town to celebrate as one. Together, we jumpstart the economic recovery of our tourism industry and revive our rich culture heritage from the land of the Banawi Rice Terraces, Arya Abra, Pasindayaw Apayaw, Adibay Benguet, Hagio Ifugao, Kalinga Shines, Gawis Ay Mountain Province, Danke Igorot Organization, Vienna.